Riled Kitty. <coughs> Hello everyone, welcome back to Riled Kitty. And today we are going to be playing The Silent Age. This is part three, and we had just escaped like that prison-like area. I know we thought we thought we were in a prison, yeah. but it was it seemed to be something else. Yeah. We weren't uh I don't know if it was an FBI place because there was that picture of J. Edgar Hoover or, or what it was, but now we're outside. Maybe we can charge our time machine back up again. Oh, yeah. So this chapter three, the machine having escaped police custody using the time machine. Joe's now on the run and in search of the time traveler convinced he has been taken to the local hospital. Actually getting there is proving difficult. I don't remember the convinced he's taken to the hospital part <laughs> i must have missed that no he's convinced that the time travel i need to get over there. there i'm not sure what i'll get out of it but i have nothing something sorry i apologize i was listening to you talk because i was trying to read it what, what were you saying rk um he's convinced that the time traveler got sent to the hospital it's completely rusted up how about this rope I want to climb back up there. It's too high to reach. Besides, I'm lucky I made it in one piece the first time. All right, motorcycle. Motorcycle is nothing but busted up junk now. Poison ivy. Don't want to touch that. Oh, that looks like a sunny patch. Yeah. Gotta be recharged. Yeah, I'm not touching that. Back door. It won't budge. All right, let's charge up our time machine and go back. Jeez, that thing almost scared me half to death. The device is lit up now. The light must have recharged it, so I guess it's working again. All right, so maybe, like, the busted door will be fixed now? Oh, hospital on the horizon. I can see the hospital. I bet the time traveler is brought there after they arrested me. Oh, okay, so he's talking about... There's a chance I might find some answers. That would be the place to start. So he's talking about brought to the hospital in the present, I guess. All right, so let's hit that. Oh, look. Hey. Why would someone have a potted poison ivy plant? I don't know. <laughs> oh, my gosh. This is poison ivy. I don't think anyone actually planted this, but it got here anyways. Okay, well, I guess oh. that makes... He had the same thoughts as us. Fire escape ladder is just too high to reach, even if I jump. All right, let's try to go in here. To find another way. So the motorcycles looks uh, looking a lot better. This one open up now. Back lot door. It's locked. Oh, there's a tool bag on the motorcycle. That could be in handy. There's a screwdriver. Um, in handy. Should I just jam this into the lock and see if it opens up? I think the door is blocked. I gotta find some other way out. All right. Well, let's try this other door. I mean, I don't have a lot of options right now. <laughs> the screwdriver with back. That door. There we go. Nice. So, what's in here? Alright, so I'm back at the police station. Or I'm back at the... So if I go, like... Can I just use this time machine? Oh, I can. Hmm. So now I guess I'm going to have to be jumping back and forth. Try to, like... Find, find stuff in one era, then jump back to the other. Garage door. The garage door opens automatically, but even if there was power, it only opens from the inside. So can I grab this umbrella? It's an umbrella. It's a little battered, but otherwise it's in fine shape. I think it's the station garage. Seems to be a lot of activity in there, and I hear faint shouting. I have a bad feeling I have something to do with it. Oh, no. Should I go in there? Yes. I know I haven't had many great ones lately, but this is a really stupid idea. They're probably already looking for me. Can I just take the car? The door is locked. Steal a police car? Are you nuts? I don't want to steal it. Even if I could get in there without the keys, I push a broom for a living. I'm just trying to walk over there. All right, let's let's do this again. Oh, geez, there's a guy in there. 
open car door. Oh. Found a nightstick, and I just threw up a little. I didn't exactly expect to find another corpse in there. I said, I have a nightstick. I don't get in cars with dead people. It's a policy that's served me well so far. So I can't, it seems like I can't walk any farther that way. Nothing going on in there. In fact, the whole street is dead quiet. It creeps me out. So can I use this to like break the window? I don't need to go back in there. Okay, so I gotta stay out. So what can I... Hmm... We got an umbrella and a nightstick, RK. Huh. What's a, wait, what's a nightstick? It's like a something police use as like a kind of a weapon. Oh. It's like a little little mini bat kind of. Okay. It's a stick, not a sledgehammer. <laughs> Can I use it with this? Jump. I can't make it. Grab, what did it say? I can't make it grab on. Oh, maybe I use the umbrella? Yes. There we go. Hey, nice. Fire escape ladder. Going up. Okay. Well, now I'm at a hotel. Oh. So there's apparently like a hotel built into part of the police station or something. Weird. A little strange. It's locked. It's locked. All right, let's try this. More poison ivy. It's still locked. All right, so let's keep let's keep climbing. Let's see what's up here. A whole bunch of laundry, carpet. Oh, I took the carpet. Nice thick rug. The detergent smells so homely. I'm still not sure if I'm imagining this whole thing. It screws with my head more than anything. Nope, you're not imagining it. It's real. Great looking pants. Alright, so let me do this now. Oh, can I go in there? Hole in the roof. Hey, the pants are still there. <laughs> See if I can jump down in here. Oh, I can. Love it. Not much of a view, just more apartment buildings. It's a wonder they get light in here at all. It's been a long time since this lamp brought light to anyone's life. Alright, let's go into the present. Nothing. The wallpaper paste. Take that. I don't know what I'm going to use it for, but... Whoever was decorating the walls, they sure left in a hurry recently, too. The paste is still sticky. Oh, looks like there's a door here. Hang on. There's something hidden behind the wallpaper. There's the door. Door to apartment 1G. Am I able to get out of here, by the way? Key seems to have been broken off in the lock. It must be in the hallway, right. I guess. Oh, the handle's missing. I'm just randomly trying things. Can I put the nightstick in the paste? <laughs> Use carpet with... All right, so let me think one more sec here. And this one's just locked? It's locked, okay. There's something in there? Oh, there's a key. What the Ooh. heck? <laughs> That's weird. All right, so how do I go back to the... Can I use it with this? 
Oh, yeah, that worked. Well, that goes outside. Oh, so now I'm just right here again. Okay, so this is the... I almost want to get into that 1G apartment. So let me see if I... I wonder if I use this rug. This is like a weird idea. Put this on the poison ivy if it'll just die. Tried, trying to get rid of the poison ivy, not keep it warm. <laughs> I felt like that was a good idea. Like you put it on top of it and it'll smother it out. Oh wait, that wallpaper paste worked? Soaked ivy. What does that do? It's swimming in wallpaper paste. I don't know, maybe it'll kill it? Find out, let me go back to the future. It's gone now. Nice. Man. Oh, the handle broke off. But that's okay, because... It fits, but the door seems blocked by something. I think I can get in this way, too. There we go. I'm in. Nice. All right, what's going on in here? Um, TV, quite a bit. TV's looking a little bit. Uh, yeah. There's no electricity. I'm not sure what I'd be watching, even if there were. Can I unblock the door? Uh. The door just opens inward. Just look at all this junk. All right, window. Let's check that out. There's a tree blocking that window. All right, here I go. Boom. Ooh, it's nice here. <laughs> There's a back alley I should be able to slip into. It's not too far down either. Unfortunately, there is another of those windows I can't open. TV's got a button. It's on. Looks like a special news bulletin. Denies any serious threat and assures us that the fatal incidents we've been reporting all morning are all completely natural and unrelated. Like a zombie apocalypse or something? Huh. I, don't, I don't get it. Modern art. Is there another key in this lamp? Like dogs playing poker. Hmm. Can I just break this window with this nightstick? Maybe that's it. Here we go. Nice. And then I'll use this carpet with this to like, so I don't get cut. Carpet should do the trick. All right, off I go. Whoa, that was chapter three, RK. Oh. And we're done. Heck yeah. That was a short chapter. Yeah, that one was a little shorter. But hey, we're gonna try to keep these parts aligned with the chapter. So we're okay. gonna have to stop there. If you enjoyed this video, if you're enjoying this Silent Age walkthrough, playthrough, let's play, give us a thumbs up. Oh, yeah. It helps push this video out to more people so they uh, can enjoy it, too. <laughs> uh -huh. um, consider subscribing. Yeah. Share this with a friend. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you think about this game so far. Um, yeah. And if you want to see more of Joe as he makes his way through time and space... Um, yeah, and most importantly, come back uh, soon for Chapter 4. I'm Hag, baby. I'm Riled Kitty. You're watching. Riled Kitty. And we'll catch you all soon in something new. Bye. Bye.